Hi there guys, how's it going? This is Matt Littermold here, and welcome to Billiard Blitz Hustle. So this is another um, Flash game that we're going to be playing, and it's by the same people who made the Billiard Blitz Snooker Star game, which was kind of really odd. Um, so basically, um, this is Billiard Blitz Hustle, and basically this is pool. Uh, this is American 8-ball pool. Uh, I believe it's American anyway, I'm not sure. Uh, but it's American 8-ball pool, and uh, it sort of works in a similar way to uh, the snooker game. Uh, in that you have, like, all the, the tournaments, you can play, sort of, uh, you know, play different players, things like that, you've got a practice table, and it's very, very similar. Of course, there's a couple of things that are actually very different. Firstly, obviously, it's pool, but um, in this uh, particular game, uh, you actually have a wallet um, that has uh, dollars in it, and basically what you have to do is, um, in when you play individual players, you play for money. So here we got, say, Captain Bob challenges me to a game for 11,000. So both players put 11,000 into the pot, and whoever wins basically doubles their money. It's as simple as that. Uh, you also have the practice table and things like that. And um, additionally, uh, during games, you can earn extra cash by performing trick shots. Now, what we mean by trick shots is basically playing things like kiss shots, uh, kick shots off the cushion, combo shots, bank shots, carom shots, uh, playing spin and things like that, um, and stuff like that. If you play trick shots and that kind of jazz and you pop the balls, you get bonus money. So uh, without further ado, I'm going to play. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to play just a single game, and then what we'll do is we'll probably move into uh, a tournament. So I'm going to accept Captain Bob's challenge over here. Right, now pretty much what what has to happen here is eventually, as you work your way through the levels, you will realize that you have to, like, similarly to like like real pool when you're playing with really, really good players, if you don't win on your first turn, there's a good chance you will lose. So I'm going to go ahead and break off here. There we go. So it works in a very... Oh, I've just gone to scratch. Look at that. You know what? That's ridiculous. Right, okay. Your break. <laughs> Okay, he's potted, uh, but obviously if you pot something off the break, it doesn't assign you a... Uh, what the hell was that, dude? Right, uh, it doesn't assign you an actual... Um, ooh, let's just hold here. There we go. Uh, so you get 10 per pot. There we go, there's our little bonus thing over there. And if you perform trick shots, you increase the amount of bonus money that you get. So we're aiming at solids here. Um... Might be in a spot above her at some point because this uh, this seven here is next to the. So if we get a combo shot here, there we go. We get uh, extra dollars for it. Unfortunately, I've messed up the uh, the cue ball. Although there may be a possibility of putting it in that pocket over there. There you go. Oh, where's the black going? Ah. Oh. Oh my god, that's terrible. So we lost a bunch of uh, money, um, but uh, we do get some bonuses because um, we made some trick shots there and things like that. And if we head over to emails, we can see that he... Uh... Yeah, shut up. I will uh, go ahead and try to earn some of my money back here, because uh, that was crazy. Uh, ba -ba 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 right. This time, let's play properly. <laughs> okay, double combo shot. Fantastic. So I'm going to get a bunch of bonuses there. Uh, ooh. Ooh, let's put a little bit of top spin onto this. And actually, we need quite a lot of top spin. Try and release something over there. Does that go? This seven, does that go past? Could get a kiss shot off the, uh, off the ten, I suppose. Mm. I'm feeling like I need to backspin out of here. There we go. Okay, I potted one of his as well, but because I potted one of mine, it's okay. I can keep going. Uh, however, I've screwed up pretty badly there, so I'm going to have to go for this one down here. Uh, I would like to actually bring that three away from the cushion if I can. There we go. Uh, I actually put it into a worse position there, though. That's a bit lame. Um, where's the cue ball going? Oh, I'm really bad at this. I'm a lot better at the snooker game than I am at this one. I've got to admit. 
but uh, my goodness me. Interesting. Where's your cue ball going? Oh my god, don't tell me I'm going to lose this as well. God damn it. Yeah. Oh, he's put himself behind the black. Interesting. Okay. He could come off the top cushion though. No, he's not going to do that. What on earth was that, dude? Wow. Okay. Uh, so I got um, control over the cue ball. I can position it where I like because this is American 8 ball rules. So you can uh, pick up the cue ball and position it where you want. Um... Yeah, that should be fine. I can put it in there. Uh, so I could do a trick shot here and earn some bonus money. Like that. Where's the cue ball going? Oh my god, that is so lucky. Damn. Okay, so I earned a little bit of that money back. Uh, I think I'll play him one more time though to earn a little bit more. Uh, oh, I still got my uh, oh, media player open. Didn't realise that. I was listening to a little bit of music earlier on. Ah, oh, I've not played anything off the break. That's bad. Uh, now, if I was playing against a better player, I'd probably be uh, losing at this point. Hmm. So we are stripes. All right. If that's what you want to do. Um, try and get a bit of backspin and cause a little bit of disturbance here. There we go. Move some stuff around. Oh, that's so annoying. Um, can I put this? See, this can sneak in. No, it doesn't actually go. I can come off the cushion for this one, though. There you go. What a shot that is. Look at the bonus point to get from that. Uh, right. Ooh, that's asking for a spot of trouble. So let's get rid of that one. Now this one, this um, eleven down here is going to be a bit of a, an issue. Could potentially try and cannon into it off of this. That'll do. Ah, that's much better. Okay, so if we put a spot a backspin on here, we should be able to run backwards. That's a really bad shot. What a terrible shot that is. Um, right, cue ball shouldn't go in here, and we should be okay to get position to go somewhere like up here. Again, that's actually a really bad shot. But, uh, where's the cue ball going from that? Yeah, I'd rather actually collide with that uh, that ball there. Okay, so we won that one. Uh, so I won the money back. Fantastic. Uh, let's go ahead and challenge... Um, really? They honestly send like emails like every single game, which is only slightly annoying. I'm actually going to take on Clive down here, who's actually a better player than me in rating. So... Try a different break. Okay, that worked. Uh, I might go stripes here though, purely because they look a little bit better positioned. Like this of it. Oh, have I really run too far? Oh, for heaven's sake. Um, let's do that then. And again, I'm going to be behind this one to aim here, or I might just be able to get to it. Oh, damn, so lucky. Um, how am I going to bust all that open over there? Uh, actually, if I play a really slow shot, I might be able to hold and go down this way. Right, so now that I can do that, power shot, get that out. I can send this one to the top. The only problem is I've got to try and release this, uh, this 11. Uh, let's actually come off the cushion and see if we can't release it this way. Uh, that's a bit too much. So 
tiny bit too much. That might work. Okay, that's got me some extra bonus points, but unfortunately I'm not really on any of these as such. Uh, the cue ball's going to go in there. I'll be lucky if the cue ball doesn't go in here. Oof. Wow. Still got bad position though. This is far from over. Ooh. Right, and again, really bad position. Cue ball could go in here. Not if I hit it soft. Whoa, there we go, right. So uh, that beat him. And yeah, that's pretty much the principle of how this game works. Now, I got super, super lucky there, which is crazy. Um, but yeah, that's pr pretty much how this game works. This is how it's... It is very similar to the Snooker Star game in many ways, except you, you're playing pool and you're playing for, for in-game dollars. And um, yeah, it's a little bit more interesting. And of course, if you enter the tournaments, then you have to pay to enter. And of course, if you win them, you win big cash. Um, so in the, what I'm going to do is I'm going to break it up here. And I'm actually going to end this particular part here. And then I'm going to make another part where I'll be playing a tournament. And we'll see how that goes. So that's it for now then. See you later, guys. And uh, if you want to play this game, please feel free to check out the link in the description. And uh, yeah, see you later, guys. Uh, this is Billy Arbit, Hustle, and myself, Matt Tomato. See you later.